the garden at St. Elizabeth, where I'm now living. As you know, I've sent out a few emails and a couple letters, but I thought today I would try a different form of communication. As we all know, today is Ash Wednesday, the beginning of the great season of Lent. Traditionally, one of the great themes of Lent is conversion. So I would like to ask, I would like to invite all the brothers to enter more fully into this Lenten season by opening their hearts to the will of God. It's a great time of looking inwardly and asking God for the grace to live the gospel more fully. I invite all the brothers in their individual life, in our lives as brothers and community, in the ministry and the work and all aspects of our life to give themselves to God and be agents of reconciliation and love. In this great season of Lent, let us remind ourselves also that this is the year of mercy. So let us practice to the best of our ability both the corporal and the spiritual works of mercy. Let us be agents of love, witnesses to the goodness of God's kingdom for all the world. I am convinced beyond a shadow of a doubt that our lives, our lives as Franciscans have great meaning. It is the gift we give each other. It is the gift we, people we work with and collaborate with. It is the gift we give to the church. I am also convinced if we can but surrender our lives to God, put our trust in the presence of Christ in our life, that all is good and all will be good. During this season of Lent, I invite you to open your hearts, open your homes, open your ministries to reflect the reality of Jesus in our life. Without Jesus, without our focus constantly on Christ, all the good work we do, all the ministries, all our presence in the world, it seems to me to mean very little. little. And I believe if we can give ourselves fully to Christ in this process of conversion, which we do daily and every year, that we will realize that God is doing for us what we cannot do for ourselves. So I wish each and every brother, no matter where you are, a joyous Lent. Please remember to pray for me and the Definitorium, and I will pray for you. May God bless you. Thank you.